Hello and welcome. Uh, this is week 52, day number two in training number eight. Uh, and we are finding businesses um, for our IRA. We help families invest using their self-directed IRAs. And so we contribute and we help you know, by finding properties in real estate or finding private equity uh, um, deals or buying a business and flipping it. Uh, also, private lending. You can do all of that inside of your self-directed IRA. And so our, uh, I guess our role here is to help you find those opportunities. So if you are a self-directed investor, uh, if you have an IRA, a Roth IRA, a self-directed IRA, uh, we help you find these opportunities. So uh, we're going to do that right now. We have a few calls. Of, today is mostly about managing all the people that we have been talking to. Uh, and so right now I'm going to call uh, somebody that we had yesterday. Look at yesterday's video for uh, Gerald who is a potential seller and he, uh, his name is Roger, but he goes by Gerald. Uh, he is, he's got a, a potential deal for us. So let me call here and just ask basic questions here. So let's see, he wants to discuss. All right, so let me call him real quick. Okie doke. Um, Hello. Hello, Gerald. How are you? This is Ben. Hey, Ben. <laughs> How is your day going? I'm doing all right. Uh, not bad. Good. Good. Just good. got out of Lowe's. Oh, that's good. Okay. Uh, very quickly, I wanted to um to to just kind of bring you up to speed. I spoke to my partner, and we want to move forward. We are we are going to move forward, uh, and. Uh, what I wanted to, to figure out before we book a flight, um, would you mind uh, just, you know, getting your truck going up and down the two couple streets and just taking a little video of the park? Would that be okay? And you can just uh, record a small little video and then, and then uh, send it over to me? Okay. Okay. So and uh, just to let you know, uh, there's one... Uh, 10 a.m. particular that I'm going through an eviction right now. Okay. And and there's a lot of trash in the front yard. So. Uh, okay. Uh, we're we're sort of broke broken down with communication. So. Gotcha. We're just waiting to get them out. Okay. Yeah, that's no issue. But, we we we've seen that before, and we deal with that all the time ourselves. That's no problem at all. Okay. So uh, yeah, I will. Uh, get that video uh, i'm headed out that way here in a minute and okay. i will do that and then i'll um yeah i'll get you an in-depth video of uh, uh, would give you a good perspective of the park okay yep that'll that'll definitely work and then once we get the video in we'll go in and we uh we, we just want to see it and stuff you know and then uh what I'll do probably by by tomorrow, I'll give you another call tomorrow, and then we'll talk about, you know, like uh, coming out, you know, booking a flight and coming out and, and just dates and that type of thing so that we can start moving forward. Okay. Okay. Well, Gerald, I appreciate it. We'll talk to you tomorrow, okay? And I'll, I'll be looking forward to, to your video later on. I'll text you uh, my email. I don't know if you still have it, so we'll text you the email address. Uh, so you can send that video. Okay. Okay. Thanks, ben. Thank you, sir. Talk to you soon. Okay. Okay. Bye-bye. Bye. So, uh, yeah, because uh, this is going to be a really good price here. 
for us. Spoke to him. He will take the video right away and send to us. Okay, let me see. Let me talk to my partner real quick. Okay, so I think I'm just gonna text him my personal number. Um, let me see if he if he's got if he's got. And th these are the little nuances that you have to think about when you're doing this. If he's got a um, an iPhone, <sighs> okay. Yeah, he's got an iPhone. This is my personal cell. You video here for easy file transfer. Thank you, okay. Okay. So, uh, all right, so here we go. Uh, so we're gonna say waiting on video, waiting on park video. Okay, and so that's gonna be for tomorrow. Okay. Okay, waiting on video. And then the, what I'm gonna do after, and this is like a huge education. So hopefully if you're watching this, you will get so much value out of what I'm about to do. So we want a video of the property and we just asked for that. And then uh, what we want also is call, Arts and look to see what other homes are selling for. Okay. okay. All 
All right, so priority on this is high. Okay. All right, so that right there is great. Now let me call Terry. There's another seller that I'm supposed to call. And on this one, we want to want to get this one under contract. It's the homes, okay. Okay, yeah, and we got to get a list of homes. I got to go back here to my itemized thing. So we want a list of all the homes. Get a list of all the homes year make etc cetera, etc cetera, et cetera. and then what we'll do as well is Okay. Okay, so that is, that is great right there. Um so now let's go over to this one here, uh, and let's see about seller carry. Okay, figure out seller carry. If they will do seller carry, hundred thousand down. So we're gonna pitch a, a creative finance deal here with this one. So let's see. All right, let's see. Code. Okay, no answer here. We're sorry, you have reached a number that. The number you have reached is not in service. This. Okay, so that was, uh, I really need to get a hold of them because I want to get it under contract. Your call has been forwarded to an automated voice messaging system. Six. Okay. Three is not available. At the tone, please record your message. When you've finished recording, you may hang up or press one for more options. Yeah, uh, Terry, uh, this is Ben, uh, Jimmy Buffett. <laughs> uh, 
uh, Ben from the, from the Navy down in Florida. I spoke to uh, your wife uh, last week and we kind of chatted about me calling today, on Tuesday, to kind of go over some of the details, especially that notice from the, uh, the city. If you guys can give me a call back, uh, the phone number is uh, going to be 831. So whenever you get this message, uh, let me know. Thank you and talk to you soon. Bye-bye now. Okay, I left your voicemail. So I'm gonna try to hit them up again tomorrow. Okay. Here we go. Okay, and then Warren, okay. Okay, I got them all. I got them all worked out, so this is good. Okay, so now let's uh, contact a few, uh, few, um, uh, brokers and do follow-ups and stuff. Uh, uh, let's see here. So we have some... Uh, Roger. Talk soon. Okay. So this one, uh, Here is our email address to send that video to, if you prefer to send via email. Okay, um, so I'm going to get Okay, so there we go. Um, okay, so this guy's going to send uh, the video, so we will see. Okay, FEMA flood plane. And this to Okay. 
Okay. All right, so. Travis Consulting Agreement. That's right. Okay, so I will, this guy, so I convinced somebody to broker a deal on our behalf with his family for a fee. <laughs> so you got to do what you got to do. That's the way I see it. So that is going to be there. Uh, you go after all the over do projects here uh owner okay ben more we talked about your park in tennessee you know the market is crazy right now if you're thinking about selling please let me know Chat. okay but not in the market so he is in florida um yeah. Do you own any parks in other states? We also operate in the Midwest. Okay, so let's give him a call. Okay, let's do it. Great. Oh. Okay, not a good number. Let's try this one here. Hello. Hello, is this Ben? Yes, it is. Hey, Ben. My name is also Ben, so <laughs> I don't. I don't want to confuse us here, but. Uh, uh, you chatted with my partner, Will, uh, I think last year, and uh, about your mobile home park and kind of wanted to follow up and see if uh, what your plans were for the park. I, I think you own several ones, uh, Midwest and Florida. Uh, so I wanted to see what uh, your plans were. Well, I have a mobile home park in Naples, Florida. Naples. And it's listed, it's listed with LSI. Uh, out of Fort Myers. So if you'd like to contact them about it, that'd be great. Okay, Fort Myers. Okay, what about the one in Tennessee? I believe that's, uh, we've been selling that out piecemeal, and I believe that's all gone. But, oh. uh, yeah. Okay. Okay. What's that? Do you know the prize, the one in, in uh, Florida? No, no, no. Run off hand, no. Okay. Okay. Uh, okay. So uh, the one in Tennessee is almost all gone. Okay. Well, I'll check out uh, the one in Ford. Um, can Can you give me the name again of the uh, brokerage? L S I Land Solutions Incorporated. Okay. L S I. And that's in Fort Myers, Florida. Fort Myers. Okay. All right, great. I'll, I'll contact them and see what we can do. All right. Thank you. Thank you, Ben. Talk to you soon. Yep. Okay, bye-bye. What were you saying? Okay, so let's see here my notes.
Uh, this is September. Has been selling it since May. Everything that's completely sold for the Tennessee Park. And the uh, four Myers or is on the market with as I Okay, so we'll follow up in six months and see if he sold it. Uh, okay, who are LSI? Okay, properties, I, I'm curious what he's selling it for. Uh, so let me see here, property time. Kelly, view matches. Uh, They have a lot of them. Okay, I'm not gonna look for it. So we will hit him back up and see. Okay. Karen is an owner. Talk about your park. Few months ago, I know the market is crazy right now. Okay, two opens originally. Not interested. So she texted that she's not interested in selling. That was back in twenty twenty one. Okay. Park in South Carolina. This is cool. Okay. South Carolina. Okay, let's see here. Karen. I don't know why my phone is cutting in and out.
Okay, disconnect. No answer. Okay, let's move on to the next. Today, by the way, has been a very successful day. I haven't put it most of the video, but today we have about two deals, two mobile home parks. So uh, that is great. Okay, bad number. Reach the voicemail for 843-709-04. Call you back as soon as possible. Thank you. Have a good day. At the tone, please record your message. When you finish recording, you may hang up or press 1 for more options. Hello, Karen. Uh, this is Ben. Uh, we chatted a while back, and I was giving you a call uh, to kind of see about uh, your mobile home park as well as to run an idea by you and see kind of like what your plans were. If you can give me a call back, uh, my number is 11. So whenever you get this message, let me know. Thank you, talk to you soon, bye-bye. Okay, so that was 0431, which is the one she texted from. So that is her. Okay. Your call has been forwarded to an automated voice messaging system. Eight. One. Four. One. Nine. Is not available. At the tone, please record your message. When you've finished recording, you may hang up or press one for more options. Hello, Karen. This is Ben. Uh, we chatted a while back about uh, your mobile home park, and I was just uh, calling you back, kind of seeing what your plans were for it. Uh, we are right now, um, you know, seeing parks being sold and things, and uh, we're actually closing on a couple parks this week. Uh, I mean, this month, and wanted to... Um, uh, to kind of see what your plans were. Uh, maybe we might find a figure that might make you happy. Uh, if you can, give me a call back. I also had an idea to run by you, but at any rate, call me uh, whenever you get this message. Uh, thank you. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye. Okay, so we left a message on that. Let's get this over here. Bad number. Okay. So we are going to try a month from today. Try them again. And see. And we never get relentless. We are relentless. Uh, okay. Go to the next task here. Gregory, okay, owner. January 25th here.
let's uh, call him. Uh, let's see, I think his clock is in South Carolina. So let's see. Gregory, let's see here. Your call has been forwarded to an automated voice messaging system. Greg Adams. Is not available. At the tone, please record your message. When you've finished recording, you may hang up or press 1 for more options. To send a fax, press 4 now. To leave a callback number, press 5. Hello, Greg. Uh, this is Ben. We chatted, uh, I think, last year, and I wanted to just uh, give you a call back. I uh, wanted to sort of see where you were with your mobile home park and see what your plans were for it. If you can give me a call, I wanted to also run an idea by you. Uh, so my phone number is 83. So look forward to hearing back from you. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye. So let's see. Okay, so we will reach out to him uh, in about a month. Let's see where he's at. Ben. Okay. All right. Hot. Uh, okay, let's see here. analyzing so before these are people that we've been prospecting for a long time um so let's see steven Okay. It was hot lead. It was hot a while back, so let's see if this is uh If this is something okay owns a park that has 300 pads on it so this could be good this could be real good uh, dawn uh, okay so let's uh Mailbox is not currently accepting messages because voicemail has not yet been activated. Please try your call again later. Este buzón de correo no. Okay. There's nothing here. Okay. No answer. Let's try this one here. <laughs>
Your call has been forwarded to an automated voice messaging system. Two, three, nine. Six, three, is not available. At the tone, please record your message. When you've finished recording, you may hang up or press one for more options. Hello, Don. Uh, this is Ben. I was uh, just kind of reaching out back to you about uh, a conversation we had with your mobile home park. Wanted to kind of just get the, you know, see where you were, what your plans were for the park, if you, you know, had thought about selling lately. Uh, if you can, give me a call back. Uh, my phone number is 311. So whenever you get this, give me a call. I also have an idea to run by you. Uh, talk to you soon. Bye-bye. Okay, so let's try this number here. Hello? Okay, someone put up what the answer. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, we'll try later. Thirty five. Ma'am Creek, this is Dawn. Hello, Dawn. How are you? This is Ben. Hi, Ben. How you doing? Good. How are you? Good, good. We had chatted uh I think a year, year and a half ago, something like that, about uh, the possibility of, uh, you know, what your plans were for the park, and we might be able to purchase it from you. No, no we're not interested in that right now. We're doing really well. You're doing really well. Okay. Okay. No yeah. problem. No problem. It always Good parks are always doing really, really well. So do you know yeah. anyone else that might be interested in selling their park? I don't. You we're don't. the only ones I know that. Are in this business. Okay. Well, that I I'm, personally know. That you personally okay. know. Okay. If you ever hear of somebody, let me know. Okay, Ben. Thank, Thank you, John. Have a good day. Bye. Bye bye. Okay. Spoke to Dawn. She said they are not selling and doesn't know anyone that might be. That's a bummer. So let's put this one on cool. Okay. Let's give her about a year and let's see where she is then. Okay, so let's see this one here. Hot, uh, bounced, okay. Can't leave voicemail. Okay. Let's try this.
Hello, we are not available now. Please call again. Thank you for your call. Memory full. Okay. No answer. Okay. Let's go on to the next. Okay. Mm. No answer on here either. Okay. So, um, Let's try in a month again. All right, let's see this. Okay. These are follow-ups, like I said, that we are doing. Do me a favor and shoot me over an email today so I can get you back on top of my pile. I want to get you working with one of my guys as well as stay engaged. Uh, okay. Here's this, okay. Signature reminder. Reminder, okay. This is a park that we're currently buying. You hear a lot of times like this guy is sending like profanities and stuff. Very crazy. Let's just put it like that. Okay, and then. Uh, so, what does he own? Let's see what he owns. He owns a park. There are plans for getting rid of his parks. He has seven parks, about 700 pats total. Okay. I have a few. Would you consider, I'm just gonna say, would you consider selling you part. Okay, let's do that. And then if he's gonna talk dirty like that, because he's talking dirty, I, I can play along and and uh surprising uh let's see here. Let me do about two a week. I'll do a follow-up in about a week. Okay. So 
So when did he call? Okay. Close and close, okay. Okay. Okay, so we have an inbox and uh, on the inbox, you know, people talk to us and stuff. So I wanted to, I wanted to go ahead and, uh, and, and clean up the inbox real quick so we can continue to work on this. Let's see who's this owner, okay. August 25th, bad number, uh, April, okay. Weeks, uh, okay, let's see here. Six units could upgrade to fifty units. Okay. Don't any other parts? It's a bit small for us. Okay, let's see. So he was willing to sell the park, but it was a bit small. Uh, let's see. All right. Uh oh, fax machine. Johnson Law Firm, may I help you? Yeah, I'm, I'm calling for Mr. Will uh, Johnson. What is your name? Uh, my name is Ben. Last name is Marks, and uh, we chatted a few months back about uh, actually trying to do business with him, his mobile home park. Uh, he wanted to sell it, uh, so I'm just kind of reaching back out to him. Okay, uh, right now, I mean, I can tell you this, they're not selling. They're okay. uh, putting more trailers in, yes, sir. More trailers in, okay. Well, that sounds good. Okay. Uh, do, you, do you know... Uh, if, if uh, he might know somebody else that might be selling, or do you know somebody else? No, sir. Okay. Okay. No problem. Well, still, right, would, you, would, you, you. would you mind passing him along a message and a phone number? Maybe sure. he might return the call. Sure, your number? Uh, yeah, it's 831. Okay. 
All right, so uh, I just gave him my number in the secretary. So they want so on. Let me call them over here. Uh, oops. I think this might be his phone number here. Oof, bad number. <laughs> she said they are putting more trailers in. Okay, I'm gonna email him. Okay. Uh, oh, Will. To, to follow up on our previous conversation. I left a message for you with secretary. A secretary with, uh, I left a message for you with your secretary Let me know. No, if you would still consider selling. Mobile home park. Thank you, Ben. Okay. Okay, so I called and I sent an email. So let's see where he's at in about three months. Follow up on this one. Okay. Let's go into the next one here. Travis Bounds Mobile Home Park owner. No answer. Currently no plans on selling, but that was the beginning of this year. So let me see here. Uh, let's call. We're sorry, you have reached the no answer. That's a bad number. Let's do this one here. This mailbox is not currently accepting messages. Because voicemail has not yet been activated. Please try your call again later. Este buzón de correo no... No answer. Okay. 
1924. Okay. Hi, you've called Travis. I can't get to the phone right now, but if you'll leave a message, I'll call you back as soon as I can. Thanks. Bye. At the tone, please record your message. When you've finished recording, you may hang up or press 1 for more options. Hello, Travis. Uh, this is Ben. I was calling you back about uh, wanting to reconnect and, and see what your plans were for your mobile home park. Wanted to uh, let you know we are buying uh, some parks, you know, and I uh, wanted to see maybe, um, you know, if you might uh, consider an offer in your park. Uh, the number to call me back on is uh, 831. Uh, and also, I had an idea to run by you. If you can, give me a call when you get this. Thanks. Talk to you soon. Bye-bye. Okay, so I left a message. Uh, let's see here. And I missed the phone call as well while I was leaving the voicemail. Skip trace. Okay. Let's see who was calling Karen. Uh oh. This is Karen, Karen, uh, South Carolina, 35 lots. Okay, let me see here. Hello? Yeah, hello, Mr. Miller? Yes. What can I do for you? Yeah, sorry about that. I missed your call. I was on the other line. Uh, I was just uh, kind of following up uh, about uh, your mobile home park uh, and kind of seeing what your plans were for it, if you might consider an offer on it. Um, what kind of offer? Well, I just kind of wanted to chat with you to, uh, to see, you know, get just a few details and we can present an offer to you. We have been buying well, parks, uh, uh, you know, uh, like this month we closed on one. Uh, before the end of the year, we're closing on another. So so we have cash to deploy and, uh, you know, we're paying, yeah. we're paying pretty good on, the, on them. So what, how much are y'all paying for a lot? Uh, right now we're buying at, Per occupied pad, we're buying at thirty thousand per occupied pad. Wow, you're stealing them. Uh, we're finding more and more. Yeah, the the because um, see a lot of people, you know, it's uh, the 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 condition of the market. I mean, it's just making people. I guess uh, I don't know what it's doing to the market, but we keep finding them. Yeah, well. Well, good luck finding them. You're not going to find mine for that price. Where, where are you at right now? Where, where would you be? Uh, more than three times that amount, but I'm under contract. Oh, you're under contract. Okay. Three times. Okay. When are you set to close? Maybe December. Okay. Okay. Okay, uh, so you're at about uh, what do you have there? Like a hundred thousand above a hundred thousand per pad. Well, when yes, yep. Yeah. Okay, and do you own the homes as well, or just I own a fair amount of homes? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, so of course we would uh, factor in, you know, the uh, the cost of the home. Uh, and, uh, I mean, we'd love to be a, you know, a backup offer if, if, uh, the, the current contract you have does, doesn't go through. Yeah. I already have a backup offer for even more than that. Oh, gotcha. Gotcha. Okay. 
Yeah. Well, that sounds great. That's not, what are you going to do at once you sell? You're, you're getting out of the business altogether? Yeah. Okay. I'm done. Yeah. You're done. <laughs> you had enough, huh? <laughs> well, I mean, uh, my wife wanted to sell, and I do what my wife wants to do. Yeah. Mm-hmm. That's a good man. Happy wife, happy life. That's right. That's right. I've been married for 17 years. Believe me, I, I, I've learned that lesson. <laughs> Well, I've been married for 44 years, and I've more than learned that lesson. <laughs> How long did it take you to learn it at the beginning? It took me a while. Well, I still haven't completely learned it, but um, I'm learning. That's what I, I, when you stop learning, you stop life. That's right. Yeah, that's for sure. You guys, uh, you guys are staying put, or you're, you have plans of moving out of state? No, we're. I mean, no, we we don't plan to. Yeah, a lot of people come down to Florida. That's why I was asking. I'm I'm in Florida. Uh, I was in the yeah. Navy, was in the Navy for a while, and the Navy brought me to Florida, and I just decided I'm like, you know what, I'm gonna stay here after the Navy because I I kind of just like it here. But, well, um, we're under contract, and like I said, and we got a backup offer that's even more than that. Yeah. So, um. So uh, wish you the best. Well, I appreciate it. Thank you, Mr. Miller. And uh, the same, the same to you. You ever in Florida? You, you, uh, you give me a call. Okay. Thank you. Thank okay, you, sir. Bye. Have a good one. Bye, bye. All right. So he said that at thirty k per occupied had. We are stealing them, comma. And I kind of agree with him. But he is under contract for about more than three times well, that price. Period. He also said that he's got a backup offer for even more than that. And I kind of chatted with him about their plans once they close to find a lending angle. But uh, he kind of enjoyed the conversation for a bit, but then uh, didn't go too far from there, period. I will reach back out to them, maybe get a couple of referrals from him. Uh, he will be followed up in about 12 months. Uh, okay. Okay, so let's go on to the next one here. Owner. This is uh, no plans on selling. One to two years on most of the homes. Almost all of them are double wides. 10 tenant owned homes. Lot rent is at 300. No answer and no answer. Okay. James.
Please enter your remote access code. Okay, so nothing there. No, no answer. James. Let's try this number here. This is the home of Betty and Jimmy Starr. Please leave us a number and a message and we'll return your call. Hello, uh, Mr. and Mrs. Uh, James uh, Alton. Uh, wanted to um, follow up. We had chatted a uh, while back about uh, your mobile home park and wanted to kind of see what your plans were for the park. Uh, and also kind of run a couple ideas by you. If you can give me a call back, uh, my phone number is, so, uh, whenever you get a chance, uh, I would appreciate that. Uh, like I said, I have an idea also to run by you, see what you think of it. Um, uh, so call whenever you get this. Thanks. Bye-bye now. left a voicemail and boom. I will do a uh, one more follow up on this. Eight. James, no way to leave a voicemail. Uh, 70 lots just moved in six homes. 70 lots, where is this? North Carolina. Uh, okay. Currently considering a $10 million offer uh, just to be closer. Park produces good money according to him. Another park, front city water and sewer. It runs 15 million a month. All right, so these are in North Carolina. Okay. The number you have dialed is unallocated. Interesting. Okay, so uh, 5251. <phone rings> Oh, no answer. Somebody picked up and probably hung up. Interesting. Let's try this one.
Your call has been forwarded to an automated voice messaging system. Seven, zero, four. This is full and cannot accept any messages at this yeah. time. Goodbye. Okay, so full. Uh, okay. I may need to skip trace. Let's try in a month again. Skip trace. Okay. Okay. Uh, so let's uh, go to the next one here. Ada. Okay. Ada is. So if we call in a year, there'll be another birthday. Okay. So no answer, no answer. Left voicemail, so nothing here. Okay. Okay, so I don't see. Um, Okay, here we go. So 17 acres, about 60 pads. So let's uh, let's give them a call. Etta. Etta is her name. Her daughter-in-law just had a birthday. Uh, it's gotta be 2257. This is John. Yeah, hello. Uh, this is Ben. I was looking for Ms. Greta. Uh, you got the wrong numbers all the way around. Oh, okay. Uh, no Etta Gray here? Nope. Nope. Okay. Wrong numbers. Okay, I, ap bye. I apologize. Thanks. No. Nineteen ten. Okay. Hello. Yeah, hello. I was uh, calling for Miss Gr Miss Etta Gray. Uh, no, uh, uh, that this is the wrong number. Oh, that's the Please wrong take, number. I, yeah, take, I take, apologize. Take, take it. Uh, that's not a problem. I get her phone calls all the time. Just take me off your list. Oh, gotcha. So a lot of people call. Okay, no problem. Yep. Yes, yep, yep. Have yep. a good one. Thank you. You too now. Bye-bye. So wrong. Hello. 
Hello, Era. How are you? This is Ben. This is who? Uh, this is Ben. Uh, we chatted uh, about a year and a half ago about your mobile home park, and I wanted to just uh, call you back and see what your plans were for the park. To keep it? Uh, well, I wanted to see if you might consider selling it to me. Nope. <laughs> Not unless you got millions of dollars with a lot of S's on it. With a lot of S's on it. Okay. So right. You, so you would consider That's the simplest offer. way I know to put that. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. If, if <laughs> I understand. <laughs> so you've owned it for a long time, huh? My husband and I built that park you, back in the started it in the seventies. In the seventies, man, and you guys has been has been making money for you ever since, I bet. Uh we've let a give a lot of people a lot of breaks. Oh, I see. You guys, you guys are kind. That's for sure. A lot of people need the help. So, okay. Uh, do you know anyone else that might be thinking about selling their park? No, sir, I don't. No, <laughs> I'm don't. getting a lot of calls wanting to buy mine. You get <laughs> how, how many calls do you get every single day? Oh, different numbers every day. Eight in one day was the most I've had. Really? You still wouldn't consider it unless nope. there's a lot of S's. <laughs> That's a lot of answers. Oh man, I I I bet I bet you get a ton of a ton of people. Anyone show up at your door yet? I haven't talked to anybody. Showed up. Okay, <laughs> okay. No, I you know I I've been trying because to... I'm not interested in selling it. That's I... what I say. If you find yeah. out I've sold it, you can say she's a rich bitch. <laughs> 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 is is this the only park you own? Yes, it is. It is. How many how many pads do you have on there? Just curious. Uh, uh how many lots? Yes, yes, ma'am. I can't even tell you exactly. Yeah. When it was set up, it was set up. It was going to be sixty some. Sixty something. It's thirteen point uh seventeen point six acres of land in that piece of property. Okay. Are you thinking about adding more? I have some big, some guys that talking about putting more mobile homes in there. Mm, okay. I run a tight ship and I put up with nothing. Oh, that is the best. That is the best. You go through, you go through my park, you think you're in the cemetery because I won't put up with no less. <laughs> <laughs> I'm very so honest about that. Yes, ma'am. That is fantastic. Are you on septic or 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 or, or uh, city? We're city water and sewer now. Sure. They were put in originally with two trailers on each septic tank. But gotcha. years ago, my husband, before he died, oh, I'm sorry to hear. But city water and sewer. City water and sewer. Well, and that's septic. Nice. So everybody pays their own water bills and sewer bills. No, oh, that is. Fantastic. They rent a lot. They pay the bill. Yeah. So, what's your plan ultimately for for the park? Are you uh, are you ever going to consider selling it? Not long as I'm doing as health wise as well as I do. I'm eighty five years old. Oh, you don't sound eighty five. You sound like they maybe... say I don't act it. They they say I don't look it either. Wow. I say I say what I mean. I mean what I say, and yeah. I enforce what I say. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> for sure. Well, I'd love to meet you someday, even if we don't end up doing business. I was, you know, you know, let me tell you a little bit about me. I, I was in the Navy for a very long time. Um, you know, I joined in, in uh, 09 and just recently, you know, last year got done with everything with the Navy. So, so, you know, I put in a lot of time in the Navy, you know, and uh, I'm just trying to build up a little, a little bit for my, me and my kids, you know, my wife and stuff. And just I've been aggressively talking to park owners, you know, see if somebody might consider selling, you know, so that's why I'm calling you today, uh, you know, but eventually, you know, maybe, who knows, maybe, maybe you like me enough to sell it to me at some, at some day in the future. <laughs> uh, not as long as I'm doing well as I'm doing. No. Yes, ma'am. I, I will tell because you this. I'll oh. tell you, my people that live there, Yes, ma'am. Most of them's been there a long time, and they can't live anywhere for where I let for what I let them live there. I understand. I understand. There's right many older people. It's sometimes if you're in Fuquay, mm. 
I could meet you down at the store building that's in the front of the park. Yeah, that'd be nice. You know, I tell you, if I purchase it from you, if I purchase it from you, I would, I would run a tight ship. You know, I know how to do that in the military. So, <laughs> so that that that'd be that wouldn't change. <laughs> they don't move people in uh-huh. unless it's okay through me. Oh, that's nice. and I have criminal record background checks oh, on people before they move in. Oh, that's good. That's good. What are your rents right now? I'm just curious. Uh, anybody rents a lot now would be at least three fifty. At least three fifty, okay. And do you? And I got a whole lot that's not paying that. That's not. It's paying a whole lot less than that. A whole lot less. Hardly none, but they've been there for a long time. Oh. It's home to them. Yeah, yeah, for sure. And I give it to these older people. It's kind of like I am. Mm-hmm. And I'd rather give it to them than to make the income and give it to the government. Oh, that's true. That is for sure. That's just old ladies thinking. I think that they'll be a lot more appreciative than the government is. <laughs> oh, well, the government, you know what's the saying about the government? The government has no feelings. The people that's running it don't. <laughs> <laughs> oh, don't, don't get me started. <laughs> hey, <one> said, uh, <laughs> you think I'm on the right page, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean, believe me, being in the, having been in the military, you know, um, one of the reasons, you know, I'll tell you this. I was in the military. I was I was trying to do 20 years, you know, retire, that type of thing. But then they started playing, playing political games, you know, with this whole thing with the virus and stuff. And I just said, you know what, I'm not going to go along with it. And that's the reason, you know, that that I got out because that you got out rather than staying on. Exactly. Exactly. <laughs> I, I was not going to do that, you know, and a lot of us felt the same way. And so a lot of a lot of good people had to uh, give up their retirement and stuff like that because. And a lot of people are doing that. Yeah. A lot of them have done that. That's right. But so many of this younger generation that wants everything give to them mm. and don't want to have to do anything for it. I've worked really hard all my life. Yes, ma'am. Now you're preaching. And now you're preaching. That's that. That okay. is that is my my thinking. Exactly my thinking. Everybody just thinks everything is easy. And anything that's in the bright name has been worked hard for it. Yeah, it's not been given to them. Yeah. So you own other properties too. Uh, my kids do now. When my husband died, the park's the only thing I left just in my name. Just in your name. Okay. okay. I let my kids enjoy it. Mm. We have other rental property around. Okay. I told them, take it and enjoy it. <laughs> <laughs> well, you're a good mom, man. That's awesome. That's fantastic. <laughs> You know, that's I, I knew from from, you know, just just having you, you know, when you picked up the phone, I could tell you're no nonsense. I'm like, I got to be on my best behavior with her. <laughs> <laughs> you know, because a lot of people, a lot of people, you know, you can you can kind of kind of tell, you know, that how they run their parks, really, because, you know, you can hear in their voice. You know what I mean? They, 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 they think. uh you know, you you can kind of tell that it's there's gonna be trash everywhere and that type of thing just by how they're talking. But you know, since you picked up the phone, I'm like, oh, she's not, she's she's not one of those guys. I'm straight up lady. That's all I've always been. <laughs> if I tell you something, it's the truth. Yes, ma'am. And if I find out anybody's lying to me, they'll steal from you. Oh. And there's no doubt about that. Yeah. Yeah. So if you're not truthful with me, you're not going to be in my park. Oh, that's awesome. That is and awesome. they're told that before they ever come there. Mm-hmm. And I say, my husband and I wrote the rules and regulations for it. Oh, we don't cool. allow dogs. Oh. At least there's no dogs or cats. Yeah. But people, I caught a lady putting cats off on the back street in my park one day. Oh. I told her, I said, you come in here again, you're going to jail. Wow. Wow. That's awesome. I'm not putting up with it. Mm-hmm. Yeah, for sure. And for sure. Anybody knows me knows that too. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> yes, ma'am. That is, that I definitely is... have that reputation. <laughs> well, it's I a... say what I mean. I mean what I say. It's good. And if I start using four letter words, you better be running. <laughs> Cause I've lost it at that point. 
Yes, ma'am. It, yes, ma'am. Yeah, that's that's uh, you don't want to mess with you. That's for sure. Let me ask you this. Do you own uh, any of the homes or just just the, just rent the lots? I own, uh, I own two, three of them. Two, three of them. That's not very many. I've owned more, but I've told them I have a guy that bought everything comes up for sale that hopes to buy the park at some point in time. At some point in time. A lot of people. You're very popular with a lot of people, I, be, I bet. How many? I, they know I say what I mean and I mean what I say. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so if uh, if we were to like be in the uh, <laughs> in the competition, you know, the bidding war for your park, what is it that we would have to do? I have no idea because I hadn't even considered selling it, and mm -hmm. they probably won't ever be sold until I'm dead and gone. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's a that's that's a solid plan. That's for sure. You you know what you're doing. You you you, you have already a. They're not making any more land. That's right. And that's that right. land is in Wake County. Mm -hmm. in Fuquay Varina, which used to be Fuquay Springs and Ver different town, Varina. Okay. And they joined that, and we were not in the town of Fuquay Varina mm -hmm. or Fuquay Springs when we started that park. That oh. park was started, we were in Wake County. Oh, gotcha. So there's been lots of changes. Yeah. What and year was this? It, back in the 70s, I can't remember. Mm -hmm. it, it's 70 something, early 70s, okay. 74, 75, somewhere in there. Okay. But it was many years ago. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. That was, that was we, it was it, we would build two lots at the time. Mm. Two lots? Wow. We started with two lots at the time. And we paid for two lots and we eventually we'd put in two more. <laughs> wow. wow, you just kept building my it husband up. was a my husband was a smart man. He'd done more work than any three men I've ever known put wow. together. That's amazing. And he'd get an idea and we would do it. Yeah. I yeah. followed him, he was the boss. Oh. Did he and did so he I had a very good too? I had a very good teacher. The only thing I didn't follow was his language. <laughs> <laughs> did he if I get to his, I get to a lot of the language he uses people better be way out of sight way out of sight yeah did he run a tight ship too but, yep he ran yeah. a tight ship he says there's three ways to do things yeah. right way wrong way and his way and you did them his way which was the legal way because he did <laughs> exactly what he was supposed to do when we were doing it oh that's he awesome. never drank alcohol nor smoked cigarettes neither oh, did i that is see that's why you're so healthy so Anyway, God is good every day. Yes, ma'am. That's right. Every day, all day. For me, he is. And I, uh, truth is truth, like I said to begin with. Yes, ma'am. And anybody knows me knows if they live out there, they better be truthful or they won't be there. It's just that simple. Yeah, very simple. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Anybody don't understand that don't need to be nowhere. <laughs> Anybody that don't or can't, you know, because some people can't even understand it. <laughs> uh, most of them don't know the truth, but exactly. they won't raise to, to do be the truth either. Oh yeah, that's right. That's, that's why, the problem with a whole lot of it. That's right. That's why. That's why I homeschool my my kids. You know, because uh, when, when I was sending my my oldest to school, I mean, they he was picking up all kinds of bad habits, and I said, you know what, no more. Is you know, I'm done. I'm done with that. Like I told you, you know, I was military, uh, and so I. Uh, I have right. a lot of those habits, and believe me, those are those habits are uh, they're they're becoming almost extinct nowadays. Uh, most people don't. I've don't seen a them. lot of it. In fact, I made my was talking to some people at Bojangles the other day, and I said, mm -hmm. "I can remember you didn't see two cars go down this road in thirty minutes. Mm -hmm. They're on top of each other now every day." Oh wow! wow. A lot of traffic in Fuquay Arena. Yeah. 401. Yeah, for sure. Most anywhere you go in Wake County now, mm -hmm. it is. It's definitely been a lot of change. Yeah, a lot of growth. A lot of growth for sure. Over here, I'm in Florida right now. Florida is just uh, unbelievably, uh, let's just say, bursting at the seams. 
Mm-hmm. Yes, ma'am. Well, it's been awesome talking to you, and uh, you know, I'll keep <laughs> I'll keep in touch. You know, I I, I don't okay. I don't give up easy. <laughs> All right. <laughs> And I, guess it. I enjoyed talking to you. Oh, and again, your name again. Your name is is Ben, and the last name is Marks. M A R K S. Dan Marks. Uh, ben Ben B E N with a Ben B. Ben yeah. Marks. Yes, ben Marks. Ma'am. Yes, ma'am. I, I was I was saying Dan instead of Ben. No, you got it. I had a, I had a brother-in-law named Dan, oh, <laughs> and, and he that. was in military. He was retired military. Well, now you know a Dan been and a Ben. Now several years. Yeah, now you know, know a Dan and a Ben from the military. Dan or Dan and a Ben that was in the military. He was in the <laughs> Army and you were in the Navy. In the Navy, that's right. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I was on the aviation side of the Navy. So I was working, I was. I would work on the hydraulics of airplanes. Right, yeah. right. So uh, I was part of, uh, you know, when we got out of, uh, out of Iraq, uh, I was uh, in a squadron that we were uh, pretty much patrolling the skies, you know, so no people would... Uh, you know, fire a missile at the troops as they were marching out of out of Iraq, you know, and, and you would see you would see like thousands just marching in the middle of the desert. It, it was it was quite the sight. Yeah, quite the sight. That's what that's what I did. Uh, it's definitely and, been many changes. Definitely. Yes, ma'am. Yes. Well, I enjoyed uh, talking with you, Edda, and uh, I'll, I'll... You can call me back. You never know when things will change. Yes, ma'am. So Yes, That's, ma'am. Uh, I'm counting on them. <laughs> <laughs> but I, I thank God every day. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. And, and ask him to lead me every day. Yeah, for sure. Oh, well, I got to take this call because my granddaughter's had surgery. I got to take this. Oh, you got it. You got it. Sounds good. We'll okay. Talk have soon. a good one, Ben. God hey, bless you. Likewise. God yeah. bless you. Bye-bye. Bye. Now. <clears throat> that was... That was a, uh, uh, you know, I should stop the video there because even though it was not a successful phone call, that is a masterful phone call, if I may say so myself, because, you know, I won't sell unless you have millions and millions with a lot of S's at the end. It went from there to, hey, I'd be happy to talk to you. You never know, Ben, when things might change. She's the one that told me that. So uh, she went from not a chance to, okay, call me back. You never know. I enjoy talking to you, Ben. Call me back. So that is really a masterful uh, phone call because we were able to get her to that point. So I will definitely uh, put a follow-up here in six months. So I will do that now. Actually, I will do uh, three months. I thoroughly enjoyed talking to Etta. Come on, she went from, I will never ever sell it. And the only way that this will be sold is after I'm dead. Come on, she went from that to, you know what? I enjoyed talking with you. And feel free to call me back anytime because you never know when things might change, period. New paragraph. A couple things for me to remember for next phone call, comma, new paragraph. We chatted about military and she told me the whole story about the park and how they built it up from two homes comma, she runs a very tight ship, doesn't let anyone get away with anything, has a very nice park. However, there's a lot of room for growth because she doesn't charge what she should be charging. And she's supposed to be charging $350 a month on rent. But a lot of people pay a whole lot less than that because she's just very kind and lets them kind of get away with it because they've been with her for a very long time, period, new paragraph. She has 17.5 acres and most of the homes are tenant owned, comma, she only owns like two or three, period. 
new paragraph. Her husband got the park on city water and sewer, but it didn't used to be that way. And there's a lot of changes to the area, including lots of traffic. And she knows that she owns a very nice park, new paragraph. She says that she has a stack of people that are ready to buy the park from her whenever she's ready to sell, period. Okay. Mention Dan in the army. Dan in the navy. Okay, so Okay, so let's go on to the next one. I mean, this is this is insane how many calls we make, but we've got to we've got to make progress here. Okay, so with that being said, let me Just some of these ones here. Um, okay, so here, there, this. Okay, let's call this guy here. I haven't heard back from him. Only six or seven. <clears throat> he's desperate to sell, but he's not picking up my calls. Please leave your message for three, one. Nothing. He's not picking up. Seven. Hey, Abby, uh, this is Ben. Uh, we are ready to move forward. Uh, give me a call back uh, whenever you get this. Thanks. Bye-bye now. Six, oh, seven. Good afternoon, Maryland. Yeah, may I speak to Abby? She's not in the office today. Sir. Not in the office today. Okay, can you take a message and let him know that Ben, uh, B N, uh, called. Ben, and what's your from what company, Mr. Ben? Uh, well, we are in talks about um, you know doing business with him. Uh, just tell him we are from uh, Elk. Five. And this is your direct line? This is. Okay, I'll forward your information. Anything else? Uh, that's it. Thank you. You're welcome. Bye-bye. Okay. Uh, let's see. Let's okay. Let's go back and make more phone calls here. Actually, let's take a break. 
Um, and then we'll come back and we'll go through these, through these uh, more. Let's call him in three days. Uh, okay. Okay, uh, let me adjust this one here. Okay. All right. So yeah, the calls get extremely heavy, but uh, we got to persevere. But we will um, <clears throat> we will go ahead and leave it right there. Uh, so um, you know we will probably do another video today. So we'll come back for that video. Uh, we are continuing to buy mobile home parks and storage facilities, and also. Uh, doing other other types of transactions uh, so that we can grow our retirement accounts, IRAs, self-directed IRAs, uh, et cetera. So uh, hit that notification bell. So anytime that you hear it uh, go off, then that means that we're doing deals, transactions. See you next time. Thank you for being here. Bye-bye now.